bad bitch. What up everybody, it's your boy CG. Now, this video is a little bit different. I'm actually entering in a little contest that um, an acquaintance of mine's um, on YouTube. We've been following, subscribed to each other for a little while now. He's running a little contest and you know, I just thought I'd do a little, I'd do my own little um, video entry, but I figured, you know, why not do my entry while also deliver value at the same time to my viewers and my subscribers. So, you know, I just kind of wanted to talk about why I do this, why I'm in this cryptocurrency space, why I want to um, create passive income for myself you know just you know over the years i don't know what it was i'm always just been that dude who you know I, i'll go i'll get a decent job you know so on and so forth a decent nine to five you know i'll do it i'll work it but you know somewhere deep inside of me i always felt like i was dead you know you know i was i'm not the type of person who likes to be told what to do you know it, it was never i was never that way I, it's just me and a th an, a th an authority just never got along you know and it's not even like um you know i'm a rebel or you know i'm trying to you know be um how can i put this um a radical or you know anything like that it's nothing like that you know i i do respect the fact that there is a moral code and there are laws in the world it's just you know it just financial independence in and of itself you know not having someone tell me how much i'm going to be making or someone else dictating what what i'm worth you know you know i just really hate that that's how society is set up to be like that's how it's set up to mold people into like i'm not saying anything is wrong with a job it's just i don't know how people can just get comfortable in the position that society puts them in you know like i don't want anybody to put me to put me where they want to put me i want to be where i want to be you know that's what i feel like life should be and passive income not, not even just passive income let's just get more to the point money we need money we need money for us to be able to do what we want we need money to be able to be free. We need money to have freedom. Freedom tickets. Money is literally freedom tickets. Like, it's, it's, it's not even, how can I put this? It's not even a, a store of value to me. It is freedom. That is what it's called. That's what those little pieces of paper are called, freedom. I don't view money as like, how can I put this? Evil. I, I don't, I'm not greedy for it. It's just you need it to survive and you need it to be able to do what you want to do. And sad to say, like I was saying earlier, society paints a picture where money is always fleeting and you'll never have enough. So you have to keep working for it until a certain point in life. It's crazy. We live in one of the wealthiest countries in the world. And yet we have so many poor people, like 95 percent of people are, you know, are poor, like, like, like broke. Like I wouldn't even say poor or broke, but they have to live for that next paycheck they have to live for it it's not a choice for them they have to do it or else they won't be able to make ends meet and you know there's only really five percent of america the five percenters out there that are really making their own money work for them and i'm a financial educator guys i, I like to educate people on these different aspects you know taxes how to shield shelter your money from taxes how to um um understand your money how to understand the um um the different tax buckets that you can fall into wealth formulas um safety protection of your estate protection of your money and being in this field i've been doing this for about a little bit over maybe a year to a year and two months three months now a year and four months and just being in this this sector you know it's crazy just seeing the control that money literally has over people especially when i talk to them it, it's it's insane the things that i have heard that people tell me that they go through in everyday life like doctors like s doctors who make six figures still living day to day you know some of them 
upgrading their lifestyles all crazy, you know, like, and they don't really understand their money. They don't really understand passive income. All they understand is that degree on, on their wall or in their office, you know, that tells them, hey, you can do this now. And that's all I want to find. You know, I wouldn't want a doctor who... <laughs> a doctor who didn't go to school for 12 to 14 years because you know i'd have to ask some questions you know like i don't want no doctor who didn't get his master's degree operating on me in a life or death situation but you know still it's crazy that people really determine their their worth off of a piece of paper that is so crazy to me that's why financial freedom, financial independence, being being free from all of the labels and the stigmas and the stereotypes that come with who you are, you know, like what school you go to, you know, what job you have. It's it, it's it's just I, I want the freedom. I just want to be free. I just want to be free, man. Like F all the BS, man. Like, cut, let's cut straight to the point. My name's Crypto Gamer, guys. I want to be free. I want to travel. I want to take my family places. I want to take my girl places. I want to take people who deserve it to places that they've never been to and to experience different sides of life that they never thought they'd be able to experience. And I want them to achieve the same thing with me. It, it's crazy. A lot of people, you know, they take everything for granted that's around them because they're being spoon fed life like you can't spoon feed somebody life you have to get up on your two feet walk walk into that living room and you know you have to bust your ass you have to bust your ass you have to you can't have somebody holding your legs while you're trying to walk like who does that what parent like like let's even just say a baby like what parent holds like holds their baby's legs while they're trying to walk and teaches them how to walk you know you don't do that shit you don't do that you know you you may be able to you know help the baby you know in a way where you're you're leading them in a, in a way you know what i'm saying you, you hold their hand but they're doing the work at the same time still they're doing the work i don't want to be spoon-fed anything if you're spoon-fed your whole life you're never going to know what to do when the spoon stops coming you're, you're not gonna know what to do when that hand just you know retracts people get too caught up in being spoon fed they get too caught up in being comfortable that's why i'm striving for what i'm all the things that i talk about you know all the all the um um <clears throat> the ideals and the goals that i have it's it's crazy a lot of people don't really take like i said serious the opportunities that they have and you know i'm not saying america's like 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 how, how would i put myself i'm not necessarily a a radical to say like i hate america you know but america's done some effed up stuff but at the same time you have to appreciate the fact that we are really we have a lot of opportunity over here and to see people squander the opportunity that that is you know the creative process that you can really take advantage of and capitalize in America, it, it's crazy. Like a lot of people don't know what to do with all of this freedom that they're given, the ability to be truly free as well. That's the really hard to grasp part. I really can't understand why people don't see things for what they are. But aside from that, um, I just want to be free. That's all it is. M money is freedom tickets. That that's that's all it is to me. It's the freedom to do what you want, when you want, how you want it, without anybody telling you, you know, how, when, where, why. You know, you're the dictator of your life. You move in the direction you want to move when you want to do it. But yeah, that's it. That's your boy CG. I'll come at you guys tomorrow with some new information, opportunities, and news. But take care, everybody. Peace.